All right, guys, we're back with a banger of a video. And today we've got a nice little treat on our hands. Hopefully it's nice. It's just a small one. We only have this one item. This is the double fried crunch. Um, it's from a place called Bird Box. They're on Deliveroo and I picked it up for nine pounds, uh, nine pounds, 95 pence. Let's, um, okay, that came off quite easy. Let's uh, see what, what this bad boy is all about. I'm actually looking forward to this because this is, um, in the past KFC has done this same thing a number of times, but I've never actually tried one. So I'm quite keen to give this thing a go. Oh, oh come on. Oh. <laughs> and it's wrapped. Um, this is a, um, it is a limited, a limited time item on their menu. So if you want to try it, grab it while you can, but let's find out if it's good. So I'm keen to get eyes on this bad boy and see what it's about. It is quite hefty. It is quite hefty, which I'm liking. It's, um, <laughs> There she is. So this is the double fried crunch we have. It's um, it's basically two chicken breasts. There's a hash brown in the middle. There's a slice of cheese and there's some barbecue sauce. That simple. This is what she looks like. That is, um, that view there looks quite, quite nice. That is what we get. Nine pounds is a bit of a missing batter, I guess you, over there. But, um, let's, uh, let me give you a closer look at it. There it is. Pop the top and see what our, geez, it's a tiny hash brown. Barbecue sauce and cheese. There ain't much to it. It's basically like a chicken burger with the, with only the good stuff, right? They've taken the unnecessary stuff out of the equation. Right, but this is, um, I guess we'll try some of the batter first. Oh, that's a promising start. This is it. I'm, I'm dying to try this thing, so let's get into this one. Lord, that is tasty chicken. It's obviously quite messy since it doesn't have a, um, a bread roll. Oh, but this is um, the coating on this chicken is gorgeous. I, I can see why they call it double fried crunch because there's definitely a nice crunch to that coating. And once you bite through it, there is a beautiful piece of chicken inside there. A really, really nice piece of chicken inside there. Two pieces, in fact. It's a very nice, juicy chicken in there. And there's a certain sweetness to the to the barbecue sauce. I haven't quite got much of the um, hash brown yet. Let's um, let me try get a bite with a whole bunch of hash brown. Oh yes.
this thing is just gorgeous. It's a bit, it's a bit on the messy side, and the um, the batter oh, the, keeps um, flaking off. But my God, everything about this is delicious. If you were to have the the, the bun, the lettuce, tomato, all that kind of stuff, it would be a pretty good burger. But this, just like it is, is is spot on. The only thing you could potentially do to make this a little better is throw a couple of slices of bacon in there. That would, that would be next level. Um, the only downside to it is that it's a bit messy and it's kind of um, flaky. As you can see, it's like crumbling apart. But all the flavor it needs is certainly there. There is no lack of flavor. And as I said, when I picked it up, it was, it was feeling quite hefty. So you're getting a, a decent portion of food. I was kind of concerned that it might be, you know, without, without the, the bun and the lettuce and all of that stuff, I was concerned it might be quite small. But it's not, it's actually, it's quite hefty. It's got everything it needs, it's got beautiful flavor. I'm loving the sweet barbecue sauce. The chicken is absolutely gorgeous. Flavor wise, it's definitely a five-star experience on flavor alone. This coating has got a lot of flavor to it. I'm not sure exactly what, how they've spiced that, but the coating has got good flavor. The chicken is nice and juicy on the inside. The hash brown tastes good. The barbecue sauce has got a sweetness to it that takes it up a level. Um, Flavor alone, five star experience. The only downside is it's it's like kind of messy, which can be fun, but it is kind of falling apart. All the batter's falling off and whatnot. So for that overall rating, we'll go a four star experience. But a very solid four star experience. As I say, if it was, whoops, flavor alone, it would be five stars. That is quite a banger. Um, yeah, as I said, nine 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 ninety five. Is that steep? I mean, that's delivery pricing. I'm really enjoying it. I'm not upset about spending that much money. I would have liked to have got a little bit more for that. You can get chips with it. Um, so the double fried crunch plus chips is eleven ninety five, if I remember correctly. But yeah, this is um, it's hefty. It hits the spot. Definitely limited time. So if you do have it available in your area, grab it while you can. It's definitely worth trying. With that said, I'm over talking it as usual. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.